Um, but Dr. Dick, one more procedure that I'd like to talk through today is um, cervical arthroplasty or the cervical artificial disc. Um, maybe you could walk us through a little bit of how it's similar to an ACDF, um, how it's different. Sure. This is the, the prestige disc. Um, and uh, there are several discs that are available now. Um, the the ProDisc C uh, is another model, um, and um, the Brian disc. But there, but basically, instead of doing a fusion, uh, you when you need to do a discectomy or decompress a nerve, you can put an artificial disc replacement in. And it's a, and the indications for the surgery are very similar to those for a uh, anterior cervical fusion, although uh, you wouldn't want to put an artificial disc in somebody who had a lot of arthritis if you're doing an anterior cervical fusion because they've got a real degenerative disc and bone spurs that are pinching against the nerve, then you probably wouldn't want to do a disc replacement. But in the young patient who, who may have had a normal disc uh, two months ago before they herniated and then uh, and now they've got a big disc herniation, they, they probably don't have much arthritis and the artificial disc is a real uh, good option for them. Um, so the procedure is very similar. Uh, again, it's going to be a, a, a young, healthy patient, um, and uh, uh, instead of doing a fusion, once you've done the discectomy, you put these two uh, components in. This is really a ball and a trough, and uh, requires the uh, placement of screws and uh, uh, a locking screw uh, to hold it in place. Um, and I don't really see much of a difference in the amount of complications you'd expect with this compared to a to an anterior cervical fusion. Okay. Are there presumed clinical benefits of the disc over ACDF? Well, this this maintains motion, and w uh, when you do a anterior cervical fusion, about one time in four years down the road, you'll have the adjacent disc w uh, become arthritic, and so it's our hope that. Uh, Maintaining the motion will will decrease that. Uh, we we don't know that 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 that's the case because we don't have patients that we've had this disc in for ten or fifteen years. Um, but it's uh, it's our hope that maintaining the motion will um, decrease the amount of fusions we have.